Hello everyone, and welcome to another video by Rich Media. The purpose of this video is to thank all of you. Thank you for bringing me to this uh, point, uh, this milestone. Um, I've reached my first goal for the amount of subscribers, the amount of people subscribing to this channel. So I really, really, truly thank you so much. And because of that, uh, I'm going to be giving away a Amazon 4K Fire Stick and um, I'll be giving this away on a live program uh, hopefully Sunday afternoon Sunday evening so we'll be looking for the uh, notification to uh, be a part of that uh, live uh, a part of that live program um, so it'll either be Sunday afternoon or Sunday evening, um, anytime between probably five and eight o'clock ish. Um, but again, you'll be you'll be uh, you'll you'll see the notification and to uh, join. So let me go through just let me go through uh, some of the things here on the Amazon Fire Stick. Uh, this is the home screen. I'm, I'm sure you all know what it looks like, but I'll just go through it anyway. Um, so, um, yeah, we're at the home screen. And on the home screen, you have your recently viewed apps. Uh, so, this is what I've recently watched or viewed. Um, I no longer have DirecTV. I have uh, the AT&T Watch TV and uh, YouTube TV right now. Uh, the AT&T Watch TV is free for me, so because I have the uh, AT&T wireless and internet plan. Uh, these are your apps that you have installed, your apps and channels. So um, I have Plex. I do have uh, MB server as well, but. I don't have that on the Fire Stick. It doesn't seem to work very well for me on the Fire Stick. Um, HBO is one of my channels uh, that I have uh, in Amazon, uh, Amazon Prime. Uh, I am going to cancel that. I just had it for uh, Game of Thrones. There you see AT&T Watch TV and so forth. Uh, Netflix, MB. Oh, uh, let's go. Let's see all. And there is all the apps that uh, are basically the ones that I that I have the uh, ones with the uh, little cloud there in the corner in the right top corner is um, saying that it's a uh, I have it, but it's on the cloud. It's not on my device right now. So if I wanted to, I could install that easily. Um, there you see ES File Explorer. Um, I believe that's no longer in the Amazon Store and the Google Play Store. Um, so if you do have it on your devices, I would recommend you not deleting it because probably I don't know. It might be back now. I'm I'm not sure. Um, or even if it was, I know it was taken from the Google, the Google Play Store for Android. Um, but there's, oops. There you well, all right. So there you see I can easily install that program or download it. I have Sony, Sony Crackle, Tubi. Those are good sources for uh, free movies with legal free movies with uh, that just have commercials. Um, Mr. MC is a um, a Cody Fork. So let's go back. We'll go home. So these are my videos. Um, my watch list. Uh, these are videos that I have uh, available on Amazon Prime, both free and um, purchased. 
or suggested. I should, well, you know, some of these, like, like, um, for example, I think some of the James Bond movies, um, they were free, then they, now they're for purchase, so they're still on my watch list. I just haven't taken them off. Um, so HBO, these are the uh, movies that I can watch right now in, in HBO. Uh, commercial, a sponsored um, advertisement. Um, we need to talk. Prime original Mr. series, uh, 4K yeah. UHD. These are uh, what they recommend, or what's available in the uh, Prime original series on uh, 4K UHD. There's a woman in the. Um, oops. So. In the refugee camp. Uh, and if you haven't seen uh, Tom Clancy's uh, Jack Ryan, I yeah, recommend it. I love it. Um, so we see Fury, Prometheus. Um, these are what's available for my viewing. These are uh, what I've purchased in my video library. Netflix recommendations. I believe um, it's not listed here, but I believe um, Stranger Things will be coming in July, the middle of July. Um, I viewed Star Trek. I had CBS All Access as one of my Amazon Prime channels. Uh, I am going to also be canceling that because I just had a first Star Trek Discovery, and I'm honestly I don't like the way. I don't know if I'm gonna um, renew my dis. Uh, pres uh, you know, re renew it when Star Trek Discovery the next season comes on. I really don't like the way it's 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 going. Um, uh, you know, let me know what you think of Star Trek Discovery in the comments below. Um, but you see on CBS, you also have the Twilight Zone. Uh, I like Seal Team, but you can also um, that's available on um, over the air. NCIS uh, NCIS. Uh, Blue Bloods and um, SWAT are also available over the air. Um, so those are the two channels that I uh, have in addition to my Amazon Prime. Um, these are some series that are available. Oh, uh, so when what I love, I like Westworld too. So when that comes on, I'll I'll renew my um, M, uh, my HBO channel on Amazon Prime. So Prime Movies. Okay, so enough of that. Um, so again, here's uh, movies, recommendations, and what I have available. Um, when a mover and a shaker, the quarterly investment report meets a dreamer and a bit. So let's go back. Uh, TV shows um, available on CBS All Access, uh, series or shows on uh, HBO, um, Prime Original Series. Um, 4K series on Prime. I believe it'll show. Uh, oh, yeah, okay. See, here we have. Um, what is this? Um, sports events on. Um, that's available, I believe, free for watching. If you have an Amazon Prime account. Uh, so you see, you got the Giants, the Murner, um, Red Sox versus Yankees, Nash, uh, Washington Nationals, um, all your favorite teams. Not my favorite teams, but feature TV, drama, um, and suggestions. These are the apps that are available that I can download. Uh, the App Store. They give you the. Let's see. These are like movies, I guess, or series that they recommend. Um, here's some apps for kids, football, uh, sponsored apps, subscription apps. Uh, entertainment, sports, no cable required, but you do require a uh, subscription fee for these uh, channels or apps. 
except for CW. Pluto TV, that, that's good. Very good free content. So uh, Sling TV, I'll be giving a review of that soon as well. Eximo, or however you pronounce that, Zumo. Um, again, it's like a, a it's a free uh, TV service. Um, you have a like Pluto. You have a TV guide, a grid, and and um, commercials. So um, the commercials uh, pay for the content. Alexa enabled. Oops, I apologize. I hopefully I didn't. Um, if anybody has an Amazon Echo or or Amazon uh, AI device, I apologize. I hope I didn't um, uh, trigger it. Popular apps in my area. Okay. Oh, ships. Well, see there. You see, I'm in Chicago. Um, ABC Chicago. Chicago. Bears, <laughs> okay. Um, apps and player, okay. Um, download manager for Fire TV. Uh, games, and you can do it by uh, view the apps by categories. And last on here is settings. So I have one notification, whatever that is. Okay, that was my last speed test. By the way, um, I have the um, AT&T Gigabyte uh, fiber internet. Um, the reason this shows uh, only 200 down and 267 up is because um, I, it's, it, it's the Amazon Fire Stick. Um, you know, that, that's probably about as fast as you're going to uh, go. I'm using uh, wireless. Uh, I'm using the Wi-Fi network on that. So um, it doesn't have a uh, very good... Well, it, I mean, it's okay. I mean, it, it works. It streams well. Um, but that's probably about the max that you're going to get um, out of it. And um, if you're kind of far away, I would recommend um, getting one of the... Um, dongles that um, you connect to the power input on the um, Amazon Fire Stick and it also has a it so you can attach power and uh, uh, Ethernet connection uh, let's see um, network you can view your network um, Display and sounds, so you can configure screensaver. Um, your dis display properties, uh, audio. I have it on uh, always Dolby Digital Plus because um, my sound system will support that. Um, and I'll get the uh, you know Dolby uh, Atmos is available. Um, through Dolby Digital Plus and Dolby True HD. Uh, so, and uh, Ama I mean, uh, yeah, I think both Amazon and um, Netflix um, broadcast their, their, their Dolby Atmos, Atmos uh, sound tracks are in uh, Dolby Digital Plus. Um, So it doesn't support Dolby True HD. Um, enable, disable mirroring. You can do mirroring. Um, screen notifications. HDMI CEC. That's where you can control the TV and the uh, uh, Fire Stick with with Fire Stick remote. And it'll turn on both the Fire Stick and the TV at the same time, or rather. Um, if you have it plugged in, the, the Fire Stick is always on. So, um, but uh, the remote will will turn on the TV if your TV supports that. 
uh, usually we'll support it through ARC or in your TV settings, you'll see where you can turn on or turn off CEC and ARC. So let's go back, um, applications. You can configure the App Store, um, Amazon Photos, Game Circle, and manage your installed apps. This is where you can um, delete the cache, delete data, and delete the app as well. I believe so. So let's see, DirecTV Now will since I'm not using that, we'll uninstall it. Uninstall, I want you to confirm, and boom, there it is, gone. What, what other app? Am I not using? Okay, so yeah, here, this is, uh, you can view, this is a YouTube player. Um, Amazon does not have the official YouTube or any uh, Google apps at this time. However, they, they say they will be having it some coming sometime this year. I would say probably um, in the last quarter of this year, um, maybe sooner. Um, so you won't need this uh, third-party app. Um, I guess they worked out a deal. Uh, we'll have to see what that deal is. So we'll go back. Oh, uh, one more thing here. You can see if I go to manage installed apps, it tells you how much space is available uh, on your Fire Stick. So actually what that means, see where it says internal space, it's not that uh, my the stick has uh, five gigabytes of storage. It just means that um, I'm using five gigabytes of, and I have one, and a quarter left. I think it has eight gigabytes of storage. Okay, so equipment control. Um, this is where you can set up um, CEC and so forth on the Amazon um, Fire Stick. Mine is automatic. This goes through the uh, the Cavo Control Center. So, um, you know, I can turn it the TV on and off as well. Um, through the Cabo Control Center, and it'll, it'll, it'll. If I had used the um, Fire Stick last, that's the device it'll go to. So, manage equipment. Um, you can add equipment, manage the TV, manage the Fire TV, uh, advanced settings. You can power uh, like a, a timer. Um, power timing, power on input. Um, and there you see the HDMI CEC setting. Uh, live TV. This will show you, okay, um, I have 118 channels available. Um, I'll show you. Um, where that's available when we go back to the home screen. Um, and these are the sources that it's pulling from. It's Pluto TV. Uh, you've got parental controls. Controlled and Bluetooth devices. So um, it says that I have the Amazon Fire TV remote. Let's see. Other blue, no, nah, it's not going to show it. But uh, game controllers, it would show, you know, you could, well, let's see. Yeah, there you go. See, it, it shows that I do have the uh, Cavo connected and that I'm using it as my uh, remote. So you can add devices, add game controllers. Um, I guess you can configure what she does um, preferences again for your parental controls data monitoring 
notifications, you can turn them on and off location, your time zone, and um, whatever metric units. <clears throat> My Fire TV, um, about, I'm not going to dis uh, display this because I don't want to give you, uh, you know, information about my network and so forth. So you can, uh, you have a sleep timer, you can restart, you can restore factory defaults, uh, accessibility, so you can enable or disable closed captioning, voice view, screen magnifier, and then high contrast text. And there you see it said, uh, you got help. So help videos. So um, if you're having trouble with something or you want to see how to, a certain setting works. Uh, quick tips. Um, it'll display where to contact um, Amazon about certain issues. Um, and then my account, again, I'm not going to display that. So there we have some of the features of the Amazon <clears throat> um, 4K Fire Stick. Um, and I'm going to show you, okay, these are, okay, so recent apps, time, featured apps. I want to go down to, let's see, okay, these are, um, I guess, what I could pair with my uh, cable subscription. I don't have a cable subscription anymore. Um, but I think I could probably pair these with ATT Watch TV or maybe um, YouTube. I don't know. Um, Spike. Uh, Show me that Spike is uh, a channel on uh, Pluto that's available. Um, these are like recommended by my, my certain apps. Uh, let's see. This week on Fire TV, I want to go down to uh, popular TV. Uh, okay, anyway, um, let's see. So let's go to, so on now, there you go. So you see, uh, this is what's viewing now. Uh, these are Pluto TV channels. You see all the stuff that's uh, available through uh, Pluto TV. Again, I'm not going to display um, any of this because I don't want to get any copyright strikes. Um, even though this is free uh, TV, here's what's available. It shows like what you can watch through uh, HBO. Um, NASA. These are probably some other Pluto channels. Yeah, see it says Pluto by there. there. So, Third every comma um, committed to memory. There we That's have right. it. But uh, there we have an overview of the uh, Amazon Fire Stick, Amazon 4K Fire Stick. Again, I want to thank you all for for subscribing and bringing me to this uh, point. Um, my next, I uh, my next goal is to get 1,000 sub subscribers. Um, I'd like to get that as quickly as possible. So if you could share, uh, if you're a subscriber and you could share my videos, um, you know, get the word out there. Um, I'm going to bring you, be bringing you some uh, more quality videos. Um, if you support the channel by purchasing some products that will be down in the link, that'll help uh, support the channel and um Bringing, bringing you more quality content. Um, and uh, again, if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. Uh, if you liked the video, give me a thumbs up, of course. Um, click that bell icon for future notifications. And um, again, don't forget to share this video. And uh, thank you all. Um, until uh, next time.